I'm Adam Rich from Thrillist.com and you're watching Leap Year. Jack, I need a publicist with experience. I know. Everyone thinks I'm a new age weirdo. There was a story that I own a bear. I can spin this. I think all of you have the capacity to do great things, to be leaders in your industry, which is why I propose a simple contest. At the end of four months, you will each present your individual plans to me. The company I like most will receive $500,000 in funding. Will you leave me alone if I hire you? Sounds counterintuitive. Jack? Yeah. You got your first client, Mr. Sather. Hope you don't regret it. You know what it is about younger men? Sorry about that lamp. It's a kind of admiration. I'm sorry about it because I can't afford to replace it. It's like they still remember how amazing we are. Hippie. What a younger man thing to say. You do know I'm like 35. Yeah. It's a great age for a man to be able to afford a lamp. And yet. And yet. Would my publicist like an omelet? I would love an omelet. Perfect. I'm quickly discovering the perks of being a business owner. I should sleep with all of my clients. You don't have any other clients. Well, that's almost true. Oh, really? Are you saying I should be jealous? I'm just helping a friend get her first gig. Isn't that what they teach in business school? I'm only asking because I never went to business school. So what do you regret? What a young girl thing to ask. I just want to know before you taste my omelet. Nope. No regrets. There really isn't much I won't do for a client. happening to her. She's tanking it. it. Doesn't even sound like herself. It's like she's still Olivia, but bathed in sadness. You know it's a cliche to say it's like a train wreck you can't Please, look away from? Just give me a chance. But it really is like a train wreck that I can't look away from. What are we all being weird about? Olivia's missing another client. Another one? It's like a soap opera. We have comedy, we have drama, and oh, now we have tears. All right, children, how about we stop being jerks and get back to our desk? I know we're all competing for the money. Go but, away, Jack. But we're also friends, right? We're still that. Yeah, so? So I want to help you. Why? Because it's easy to get discouraged, and I just saw you crying in your meeting. I had an onion in my coffee. I'm doing fine. I know. You're great. You'll get this thing off the ground. Good. Now go away. I'm not doing you a favor, and this isn't pity. Then what do you want? Hire me. You have a publicity problem, and I'm a publicist with a lot of time on his hands. What's my publicity problem? Well, for starters, nobody knows who you are. So... What are you doing for me today? Well, after taking you to the very heights of ecstasy, I thought I'd work on your website. And they say romance is dead. Oh, and I killed that bear story, but you're gonna need to get a really big dog. Jack, I'm really not a pet person. People like pet people. Pet people are human and relatable. Do you want to be inhuman and not related to anybody? Okay, I'll get a dog. A very small brown dog that could have been confused with a bear cub. Anything else? I'm still working on the rest. I'm trusting you, you know. I know. I'm going to repay that trust with my body. I'm serious, Jack. I trust my accountant with my money, but if the money's gone, it's gone. Me, the stories of me, that's what I leave behind forever. Maybe it sounds really dramatic, but I'm trusting you with my life. Hey, you don't have to worry. You're in good hands here. Good. Now... Let's break something else in my house. Okay, ready? And tweet. Good. Now Foursquare. And finally... Facebook? Yes. Are we done? And now we repost each other. And go. Okay, now? Now we wait for the world to contact us. Are you Jack and Olivia? Yes, yes we are. Well, I just saw your check-in on Foursquare and, and I was wondering... And you're looking for a publicist. No, actually, I was... A what? business consultant? No, no, I was just curious what role you'd recommend I get. I'd recommend the Maguro role. Great, well, how many stars would you give it? What? You know, how many stars would you give it on... Do I look like Yelp to you? What's wrong with you? Oh, you were so getting a bad review. Social media needs time, too. Okay, Jack, I really appreciate you trying to help me. But 
I feel like I'm wasting time that I could be spending calling people using primitive technology from the 20th century. Give me one day. I'll get you something. I'm not promising a client, but I am promising a win. I meant a phone. What I said now about using 20th century technology, I meant actually using a phone. Okay, Olivia. Sure. Just get me a win. Okay, good. And Jack, if you could hurry, I don't think I can afford you much longer. I'll call you later, let you know how things are going. Okay. Maybe I'll set something up, something to remind the people that the big famous writer's still big and famous. Maybe a book signing or a lecture, I think. Jack. Yeah? This was fun. You want to do it again? Yeah. I think I do. Radix Consulting. Uh-huh. Uh-huh. I can have it to you by tomorrow, no problem. Great. Thank you so much. Bye. Ah! Thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you! I'm not sure I know what just happened. It's a featured article on Mashable. How did you make this happen? I'm good, Liv. I'm really, really good. Nope. No regrets. There really isn't much I won't do for a client. Hi, my name's Jack Sather. I represent Scarlet Lane. I'm calling in regard to my client's protege, a terrific writer and a business consultant. Somebody Scarlet feels would be an excellent candidate. You're making the lunch come up out of my mouth. Oh, now. What's the column about? It's about this. It's about us. It's about our office. It's about our company. It's about starting your own business. It's an article about a business consultant living the life or something. I don't, you know, I don't really remember what he said over the phone. So are we mentioned in it? Of course. Mentioned by name? Yes. Well, then I guess we get out of here. My Olivia and Jackson alcohol. Congratulations. Thank you. Okay. Yeah, congratulations. Thank you. Good job, sir. Thank you. Thank you. I'm a business consultant with a failing business. Then you gotta do it. Why, because I have no morals? Because you gotta put your career first. Hello, this is Aaron's office. We're currently closed right now, even though I'm still here, slowly dying inside. She made my perfect brother look dumb. It was a mistake. It was a big mistake that would have cost me a lot of money. God damn it! Jesus, Olivia! You have to fix it, or you're gonna be very seriously screwing me. You're drunk. I did something bad, Liv. Take a sip and another, oh, I do this every day I wonder why I try to avoid the cuts Cause the truth is they say it hurts Na 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 na